But we begin this half hour with a campus controversy at Duke University, and we should warn you that some of the details are graphic. It started as a joke between friends, a female student's list of the athletes that she says she had sex with during her time on campus. But now it is all over the internet. NBC's Jeff Rawson is at Duke with details. Jeff, good morning to you. Hi, Meredith. Good morning to you. Yeah, this one is a doozy. People gossip all the time with their friends about sex, I've been told, but, th but this is something entirely different. Karen Owen, when she was a student here at Duke, says that she had sex with more than a dozen men, most of them Duke lacrosse players. But instead of going back and gossiping with her friends like most people, she sat down on her computer and wrote out this 42-page PowerPoint presentation, very well put together. It has pictures of the men, their names, everything. She emailed it to a few friends, and then it leaked everywhere. That's her, Karen Owen, these days Duke's most infamous author. And she's naming names. The men who were good and bad in bed. Karen even ranked their performance on a bar graph. We're hiding their identities, though Karen didn't. She wrote it like a thesis. The title, Excelling in the Realm of Horizontal Academics. She writes about her sexual exploits from her sophomore year all the way through her senior year at Duke. She just graduated. Karen calls each man a subject and sex with them data collection. She brags about having sex in the Duke Library during finals week and in SUVs. But Karen also came off vicious, saying of subject number one, it was over too quickly. Here on the Duke campus, it's the hot topic. It's funny that we know the people on it. And did you read any of it? Uh, I skimmed parts of it. It was a uh... It's very detailed. <laughs> Karen says she often met the men at campus bars like shooters, the sex often fueled by alcohol. In my blackout state, she wrote, still managed to crawl into bed with a Duke athlete. In fact, she claims all of the men were athletes, most of them Duke lacrosse players, a sensitive issue around here since the Duke lacrosse scandal of 2006. A stripper accused three players of rape at a team party. In 2007, the charges were dropped but the damage was done. Some here say this new sex scandal won't help the school's reputation. Is this the last thing this university needed was something like this? Karen's thesis has gone viral, posted on several websites. You see, Karen sent her sex ranking presentation to a few friends. Then they emailed it around, then they emailed it, and so on. A growing problem. Nothing is amongst friends. If it's shared online, it's shared with the entire world. Young people, they need to realize every time they hit send, it's like a bullet leaving a gun that you can never pull back. Still, at the time, Karen seemed proud of her work, writing, got some fantastic stories for the grandkids. But clearly things have changed. While Karen wouldn't speak with us on camera for this story, the website Jezebel.com is reporting that they did interview Karen since all of this came out, and she now says she regrets it and would never intentionally hurt anybody on the list. By the way, Meredith, we also reached out to Duke University. A spokesman from here wouldn't go on camera either, but told us the well-being of their students is their top priority, and they're reaching out to everyone involved. All right, Jeff Rosson, thank you very much.